goodness. From goats and gators to dogs and ducks, more than 100 animals removed from a home in Milwaukee. Yeah, and the owner now facing potential charges. Mary Jo Ola reports on where those animals are now and what's next for the owner. We're here at the Milwaukee Area Domestic Animal Control Building. They were called in over the weekend to take in 112 animals from a single home. Right now, workers are focused on getting many of those animals to the right organization where they can thrive. There was just animals everywhere, and it was very unusual in the the aspect that it was so many different kinds of animals. Karen Spiripani is the executive director at Matic and Milwaukee's humane officer. She gave us a closer look at the parrots, goat, alligators, dogs, and more that were seen. They were friendly, socialized, they're all placeable, and that's not typical with the um, traditional type of hoarding case. Milwaukee police called their team during an animal cruelty investigation at a home near 9th and Locust. Sparapani says the living conditions were poor and they found some dead animals at the home. However, it still appeared the owner cared for the animal. You understand your home is not a great place for large quantities of animals. It just isn't. The home is boarded up now. On the door, we saw a notice from the city of Milwaukee that found the home is unfit to live in, citing unsanitary conditions. Milwaukee police took a 46-year-old man into custody. The district attorney is reviewing potential charges. Mary Doola, TMJ4 News.